And now welcome to stage the fifth speaker of the League of Team Pet Ladies and gentlemen, I stand here before you on behalf of this beautiful, complex, first class symbol of love. The Rose. I stand here before you to put these fallacious arguments of the affirmative team into context and correct them. Now, I begin with the definition. My learned friend here has failed to define the, the moot sufficiently, so we the negation team have taken that responsibility ourselves and defined cabbage and rose as metaphorical meanings and better as advantageous. In rebuttal to the chief points in here, where is this proof of the anti aging that we good effects? He has not supplied any, any names of paper research to back this up. Might I start by altering, by alerting the ladies and gentlemen present that cabbage is a colloquial term referring to marijuana. Yes, marijuana. Weedy, chronic, wacky wacky, call it what you like. It's all cabbage. We all know the adverse effects associated with the consumption of marijuana, but I'm going to remind you of them anyway. Memory loss, slow thinking and learning, bad fitness, and of course, a really bad smell. Need I say more? This definitely outweighs a little bit of vitamin C and anti-aging. A little while ago, the customs in America were alerted when a simple dog were attracted to an inconspicuous looking gentleman. Now, sneaky is not a word I like to use lightly. But in this case, a certain man and his cabbage were, in the words of Mr. Deedy's brother, very, very sneaky. <laughs> These these simple dogs are often false alarms, but, but you know, not this time. This guy was creative, I'm not giving that, but the fact that he had in 1.6 pounds of goods in his cabbage tells us that cabbages are lying, deceitful. They are not up front, they are the backstabbing friends. These layers are not always beneficial. Would you ever see someone with a pound of drugs in a rose? I don't think so. Everyone needs protection, and these plants have protection. A very popular bomb rock song communicates to us the message that every rose has a storm. Indeed, every rose does have a storm. But at least that, that a rose can get itself out of trouble. It's protected. A rose has storms which are undeveloped leaves, and these serve as a protection mechanism against herbivores. In other words, there are a biotic response to the environment, and I now ask you to cast your mind back to the August of 97. This is a very emotional time for us when Princess Diana died. Alton John called Princess Diana the English Rose in his song Candle and Woman. This is the metaphor that in our case suggests it's larger than my saving figure for a rose. Alright. 